the place where science comes alive. Today I'm going to interview two sets of twins as part of our series about genetics. Every year when we study genetics, one of the most commonly asked questions is, why are some twins identical and some twins totally different? So let's take a look at the biology of twins. I'd like to tell you about the biology of twins. So it's as simple as fraternal twins are two eggs, identical twins are one egg. So there are two eggs and one sperm here, one sperm here. So these children, these twins, one is going to have totally different DNA than the other. Just like any other brother or sister, their DNA is completely different. They're just born at the same time. They could be two boys, two girls, or a boy and a girl. With identical twins, however, it's a single egg and a single sperm. And sometime between the first and the eighth day of development, the egg splits, and we really don't know why and create two different halves that develop into the identical twins. These twins have their DNA 99.9% .9 the same. Okay, so welcome Damien, Dominic, Sabrina, and Susie. Um, okay, so what's your favorite color? My favorite color is black. What's your favorite color? Black. What's your favorite color? Green. And yours? Green. Okay. Alright, how about, what's your favorite ice cream? Um, my favorite ice cream is Rocky Wood. Okay. Okay. Rocky Wood. Cotton Candy. Okay. Alright, so there are some similarities and there are some differences in these twin sets. Okay, so, what's your favorite part of being a twin? Speak up so they can hear you. Um, my favorite part of being a twin is like, oh, Having a brother that's the same age as you, then you can do the same thing. Okay, how about you? You can share some clothes. Oh, <laughs> and your, what's your favorite part of being a twin? You know, like people can get to school. Okay, and how about you, Sabrina? You, you always have someone to use you and never be alone? Oh, very good. Okay, now how about, what is the worst thing about being a twin? That, like, sometimes your parents, they get mixed. Oh, okay. You have to sit here and close. Oh, so that's the best and the worst for you? Okay. What's the worst part about being a twin? She wears my clothes. Okay. Sabrina? She takes my stuff or she wears my clothes. I would get compared to her. Ah, okay. How does that make you feel when they compare you? Makes me feel like I'm not Susie. I'm um, myself, not her. Okay. And so do you speak up when, when that happens? Sometimes. Okay, that's good. Okay, so um, I'd like to give each of, uh, ch each of you a chance to ask the other set of twins a question. So let's see if you can look at each other maybe and ask the question of each other. I'll back up and let you do that. So let's start with you, uh, Susie. Um, when you were younger, did your parents get dressed as a thing? Yes. <laughs> okay. And what would you like to know, Sabrina? Can you guys tell how I feel when something's wrong with the other thing? Mm -hmm. No. Okay. What would you like to ask the girls? Um, do people think that you guys are like a year apart? Yeah. yeah. You can have them with yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes. Okay. All right. All right. So, um, okay. Well, this has been a great genetics lesson, and I want to thank you for staying after school today to do this with me. I really do appreciate it. Okay. All right. So, Justin. Tell us what spectacular science you have ready for us today. This is a live cam of a bald eagle nest on the California Channel Islands that has two eggs that are about to hatch any day now. Check them out at Channel Islands Live.
Thank you, Justin. That is a spectacular science. I'm excited to see if those eggs hatch this weekend. So, everybody, join us again for Science 7, where science comes alive. <laughs>